What's going on, guys? My name is Ren XL. It's your boy, Rabito87. When we started off this year doing our recording for our movies and all that stuff, yeah. we had our top 10 most anticipated movies of the year. Yeah. And I can say, as we watched these movies, plus a bunch of other movies we were anticipating and all that stuff, uh, that top 10 has changed quite a lot. Yeah, uh, yeah, definitely for a me, lot. man. I've, I've been waiting to do this for... No, um, you have for the, the, for a long time. I've been waiting for this. for this. I've not been looking forward to this. I I have. Because I've been looking forward to it. My tastes are different from a lot of people. Yeah. So my top ten, what I enjoy watching, is gonna piss everyone off. I, can I feel it. It's gonna. I mean, come on, man. Every, everybody's gonna be. Mad. But that's what makes it great. Cause like I said, when we're done with this video, you can do tell us your top ten movies of the year. Pretty sure there's plenty of people doing it. But this. But like I said, this is personal. Okay, this is our personal stuff. So yes. please, I'm begging you. It's okay to be mad, but don't take it personal, man. Just, 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 just please oh, don't. It's personal. <laughs> it's gonna be. It's, it's, it's cr- I'm, I'm excited because, like I said, I'm, I want to hear his top ten. I kind of already know. Uh, like I said, do this, you? Yeah, do I kind of already know what's gonna be. Hope see what his number one. But <laughs> I am gonna say this though. Camera. The movies that we had, like like I said, if you check out our video when we did the most anticipated oh, movies of the year. I was floating across the screen right now. You know what I'm saying? The most anticipated movies of the year. Over there. Check that out first and see which movies we picked. Because like I said, the movies, I was making fun of them. I said, Man, I ain't watching this garbage. But then I realized, I was, like, I was like, dang, I should like this movie. I'm mad as heck right now. I, I, I was hating <laughs> over this shit. I did not want to watch That's this movie. That's the movies you seem to enjoy. Yeah. The ones you're not anticipating. The ones you don't know about or exactly. have expectations expect for, you enjoy. Then you have... Yeah. Adversely, uh, the ones you enjoy, you're looking forward to. I'm looking forward to this movie. They drop your expectations down. And that's what I'm saying. Which, that, which we are going to do a top ten worst slash disappointment movies next. All right, but, let's start off with number ten. Yeah, we're going to say the exact same time, and then we stare each other in disappointment and hate. Yeah. Okay. All right. Ready? Yeah. Number ten. Smurfs. Beauty and the Lost Beast. Village. Really? Really? Smurfs. 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 Really? Beauty and the Beast. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Do you thought Smurfs was that good? I loved it. I, we didn't do. We didn't yes, get. Yes, it to, was a good movie. We, we didn't get to do a review on it. Um, but personally, to me, I felt I love Smurfs Lost Village. I love the whole, okay. you know, the whole like instead of just guys being Smurfs, it was female Smurfs. I just love the storyline. I loved it, man. It was great. Um, I, I liked it personally. Me. I mean, we didn't get to do a review on it because of stuff that was happening in the we video. We tried doing. We reviews, tried to do it. Bad camera, bad technical issues. But yeah, we tried. So we, we, we did a review, but we couldn't put it out. But at the same time, I, I love the movie. Had to put it up now, there. Now, so why the Beast? Is it, yeah. Because I, it was a live action make, remake of a cartoon that I really liked, enjoyed, Disney cartoon. Okay. In the old days. Good, gra- really good graphics, and it was just on my list. It's not high up on my list, but it's one of the top ten. We view, we watched, it actually reviewed like I think close thirty, forty odd movies this year. Yeah. Plus others we didn't review, more we watched, and all that stuff. So I, that's I'm pretty good. Uh, I had a little bit higher on my list though. Oh, did you? Yeah, oh, okay. So. Oh, you haven't on your list at all. All right. Let's go piss everyone off. Next one. No, all right, nine. Number nine. Justice League. Beauty and the Beast. What? Yep. How is Justice League? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Justice League number nine for you? Mm-hmm. Man, you crazy. It was heck, a man. good movie. I like I like That's why it's on my top ten best of the year. It was a good movie. But the CGI was just so overdone. And this is halfway through the movie, the story was you already know what's gonna happen. When Superman came back, it was done. It was like, well, there was all the uh, stress and all the build up for the end of the movie. It's still gone now. So Justice League's back. definitely higher on my list. I like well per- well personally it was, it, it was Justice League was higher on my list. Okay. It was. Okay, that's fine. Um, personally, for me, the reason why Beauty Beast is number nine, because like I said, um, and, and if you checked out the review, I just love the way they did Beauty and the Beast for, for Disney. Um, personally, I, personally for me, I wish I had a daughter to take to watch that movie because right. it was just it was just it, it's a Same great that. movie. If you have a daughter, this that movie was perfect to take out and I mean to to take her out and all that stuff like that. I really loved it, and not only that, I love Emma Watson. The only problem I had with the movie was I didn't feel like they were portraying the characters very well. You know what I'm saying? I didn't feel like Emma Watson was Belle. I didn't feel like the guy who played Beast I played see. Beast very well. Beast I mean I mean I mean, I mean I mean they they did good, but yes. it wasn't I didn't feel it. Like I wasn't like I didn't say like oh he's a beast. Oh man, you know, I didn't really like it that much. You know. I like the way it portrayed it overall. It was a really good movie. Yeah. But you apparently you liked it better than I did because you were higher yeah. than me. I, I liked it. It was just I just didn't think they embody the characters well. Okay. But overall the movie was phenomenal. I loved it. I enjoyed myself. I Hey, that was my that was my only problem. I definitely okay. it. But man, yeah, I know Justice League. Yeah, that's gonna be me some hate. All right, number, number eight. eight. Ready? All eyes Get on out. me. What? Mm-hmm. Wait! Wait a minute! It. Wait a minute! Wait, wait! I enjoyed that movie. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Yeah. Wait a minute! 
You got All Eyes on Me on your list? Yeah. Wow. It was a good movie, suspenseful. Well, I, I, I was getting this. into it. The music, I, I, I wasn't really into that much. It was acceptable. But the story, I, I like stories based on that much realism. It has that much going on, I that much drama honest, going on. I can't understand why you liked it. The reason why I didn't really put it on my list, because like I said, I mean, I know I... I'm a big, we're well, not the biggest Tupac fan, but just the way they See, put the story together. Issue. I don't know much about him, so yeah, watching this yeah, movie so, was yeah, a good maybe. look into something I don't know about at yeah. all. So I personally, to me, it was I. Right. I didn't wasn't really feeling it. Um, like, I'm glad I went. It to was a movie. good. I'm it was, you took me, this so. movie was. It was. It was. You got him. <laughs> yeah. it was awesome, but uh, <laughs> but uh, but but personally, to me, I like Get Out better. Uh, I just even though I wouldn't watch it again. Uh, because it's just it was just whew, it was so deep with that stuff. Get out! It, I can only watch it one time. I mean, <laughs> There's I a creep watch. factor going on. It was on very there. creepy, uh, but it was a good movie. I had to put I had to was, put Get Out was. out there. Uh, Jordan Peele did a phenomenal job directing it. He is making a Get Out too. Are they? Yeah, they're making a Get Out too. I thought they so, killed everyone. How think you're going? I, I don't know what he, what he's going to do. Okay. He's saying he's, getting, he's making a Get Out too. Which I personally, me, I don't think they should. I I don't know what well, else they, they killed do. all the bad guys the uh people taking over the bodies yeah so i don't how are they gonna do that so there's a cult going on yeah. even bigger so but i'm surprised right. with the tupac i am uh in shock it was i enjoyed the movie i don't know much about I, it so I, 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 a lot of people didn't like it because it wasn't based on realism or they, no, they no, it was it, just, it was real but no, they it was the way they put it together the details more. yeah well the way they put it together it just wasn't yeah. uh, just yeah. i enjoyed that I so right. this is our personal review yeah. our personal opinions of the i'm shocked with tupac i'm in shock i knew you would be i have a shock with this one Number seven. All right, ready? Yep. One, two, three. Murder Justice on the Orient Express. What? Yep. I don't know. About really? That. I like that, that movie. Even on I would see the movie several times. I would. Uh, really? Yeah. Oh, man. We well, mean you saw that. I was someone it else. Was, uh, mm. Mm. Nah, one for me. I, I, it like, was, well, I like, like the whole murder mystery drama movie. thing going on. I very, know what happened. Very disappointing movie. I, really? Yeah. Okay. Uh, reason why? Well, 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 yeah. Reason for I, well, I, I chose Justice League. Like I said, uh, I didn't know what to really expect from this movie. I think it, I think it was great. Uh, the only thing that was bad was the CGI and the costumes. That was it. Storyline was great. Uh, so now the the only the storyline was good until Superman came back. I yeah. just can hope he, I liked gonna, it. He's gonna I like Superman when he came back. I know. I, I liked it. him, but. The the dramatic effect of the movie would just died off after that. It's like yeah. he's gonna beat him, doesn't matter anymore. Mm, nah, I I liked it. I liked the way he and came. He did. Back. He came up, punched cool. him, and flew him into a building. I think and for me, it was just the the expectations was a little bit low. But then I watched. I was like, oh snap! So I liked okay. Justice League. I thought it was good. I liked I it too. It's on my top ten, but it's just not yeah. high as yours on the top ten. Yeah, mine, all, right. all right, number six, two, three, Planet of the Apes. What? Yeah, <laughs> that's higher. Yeah. What? Yeah, get so, out. Really? Mm-hmm. The mystery that was going on, trying to figure it out and puzzle through it, that was yeah. fun. I enjoyed the movie that way. Just the overall creep factor. Things were not going as you expected. And you're like, you felt involved. It was like, don't do that, man. Don't do that. This is going on. That was going on. I felt involved in the movie. I enjoyed it because of that. Really? Yes. Would you watch it again? It was, yes, I would. It was a horror. It felt like a horror movie. It wasn't yeah. actually a horror movie. You know the, uh, the, uh, the, which, uh, the, you know the Oscars made a comedy? They said, yeah, they called it a comedy, and they're not happy about that. It's not a comedy. No, that's not a comedy. No, it was. It was it, it, a comedy. Yeah, they made it into a comedy. Maybe they, because the directors could, used to be comedian, maybe. Yeah, but maybe, there's no comedy in there. Man, they just—it's stupid, man. There's an element um, or two of funny parts in there, especially the uh, cop friend or the. Yeah, remember? I mean, there was some funny parts. Yeah, no, but at the same time, no. it wasn't a comedy. All movies have funny parts. Like Thor is not a comedy. Well, it might be, but there's a lot of funny parts in that movie. Um, all right, number five. Um, well, okay. oh yeah, that's right. Eight. Well, Sorry. for me, playing out the apes. Uh, the reason why I chose it was hard. I'm not gonna lie. There was a lot of a lot of a lot of choices I had to make, and I'm not gonna lie. I did not want to put Planet Apes up here, but I I, I have to, I, I can't I have to admit this was a great movie. He what actually it? had it on his most anticipated movies, and okay, I wanted to hate be, on the movie only because I've seen the, all the other yeah. Planet of the Apes movies and I enjoyed them, and I, I enjoyed this one as well. I I can't deny this was a great movie. Uh, the storyline was great. The actors did a phenomenal job. I mean, I was yeah. moved with, for this movie. I had to put it up there. I had to. I, I I tried my hardest not to put this movie up there. <laughs> I wanted to hate it so bad, but it was too. It was too good. I had to put it up there. I gave you it a ten. I gave That's it a right, ten. You did, didn't you? I That's gave it a ten. Right. I, I I I I didn't I, give a single movie a ten. I gave it the high nine as high as I went. Yeah, I, I I loved it. I loved the movie. It was good. It was great. Was that good? Okay. I had to get put it up there. So right, number five. Notes. Number five. Halfway done. All right. Number five. One. Ready, set. Two. Three. Star Dunkirk. Wars. Really? Yeah. Really? Don Kirk's up there. Wow. Okay. Like I said, same whole issue. I love movies based on realism. Yeah. Like Dunkirk was based on World War II, I think it was. Yeah, World War II. It was World War II. 
Um, yeah, no, I think it was Voyager. Yeah, yeah, But yeah, just yeah. seeing the events that happened during there and how remarkable things happen in everyday life, that's yeah. a good thing to watch. All these movies are superheroes, all that. Those are fun to watch, too, but you know it's a fantasy. You know it's fake. Yeah. Dunkirk is based on some sort of realism. Yeah. So it's like, okay, this actually happened. Not the maybe not each individual story is going on, but it's yeah. there. So that made it more enjoyable from to my ass from to me. Yeah. All right. Um, How'd you like for me, Star Wars, you know, I, I it was my number one movie of the year, but at the same time I watched it. I enjoyed it. Um the only thing that was kinda of bad about the movie was I just felt like they didn't put enough details in it, they didn't put enough work into the movie for me. There were some things I wanted to a little bit more details okay. in some of the story. But overall, I mean, it was still a good movie. I mean, definitely top five. I mean, it was still good. It's just, I just, you know, they could have did a little bit better. I feel like they were kind of being lazy on certain things. But eh. other than that. Other, well, other, I put into it. They make yeah. a lot of money. Huh? Oh, I guess they made a lot of money. Yeah, anyway. they made a lot of money. But at the same time, I just, you know, they could have been better. All right, number four. All right, Ready? number four, yeah. Oh, sorry. Put number four. List. Ready, set, Blade Star Run. Wars. Blade Runner. Yeah. I took, Blade Runner's not even on my list. Okay. Blade hey, Runner. It wasn't on my list either. <laughs> I have a list here of all the movies. Me. It's on the back of an envelope, but all yeah, the movies we saw. Are you serious? Oh, crap basket. All right. Wow, I didn't put Blade Runner up there. Wow. Well, it would have been if I hadn't remembered it. Oh, well. Wow. Well, Star Wars then for me. Why? Well, for why, the same aspects. Why, why, it's so? high because I enjoyed the movie. It was a really good addition overall, but there were a lot of disappointing parts happening. Yeah. Like, I wish they would have exa- extrapolated more on Snoke. I know he died, I but agree. where'd he come from? Where yeah. did he go? Come that, Joe, all I, that crap. I agree. Um, um, so there's some more explaining that need to have happened that yeah. they didn't explain on, which is that, why it wasn't the greatest movie out there. But yeah. it's high on list because it was an enjoyable movie, and I was anything Star Wars is awesome. I said the same thing. I, I that's what I'm saying. For Star Wars, I kind of was like, eh, yeah. you know, uh, Blade Runner. Uh, it was one of those movies, man. I was. Whew, I was getting excited. I loved it. Even though the first movie, the first Blade Runner, was boring as hell, I didn't think I was going <laughs> to like the second one, but I loved it. Um, I can't wait for them to do another Blade Runner. Hopefully, got, um, you know, th- hopefully they continue the movie. But other over overall, the movie was phenomenal. I had to put it over Star Wars. I mean, I, I had to. I mean, it was too good. I mean, it was. It was, it was great. It was great. Movie. It was great. We had we did a second discussion on that. That's how good a movie yeah, we had a discussion was. Blade Runner was good. Time. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't. It, it was. It wasn't even on my radar, and it was just a phenomenal movie, man. Those are the best great. movies. You don't even know they're in. I was like, we're gonna see it. Like, yeah, <gasps> yeah it was. Where great. has it been all my life? Yeah, like it was great. <laughs> I, I loved it. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't watch the first one. Absolutely not. Boring as fuck. But this one right you here. You watched the first one. I mean, we did. No, no, no. I mean, I would watch it again. Oh, okay. But this second one, I mean, it was just. It was just phenomenal. I okay, loved it. Okay. Loved it. Loved it. They Number did a good three. job. And I don't. I don't really like dialogue movies. It was a lot of dialogue in it, but it was. I was well because it's sci-fi dialogue and keeps you in trance. There's that, just that, enough that, action in between the dialogue to keep yeah. you. Yeah, uh, but but that's what I loved about it. I was so focused. I was like, oh, I know what's gonna happen. I understand. Like I just loved it, man. <laughs> it was. I was. It was great. Now, would you say watching the first Blade Runner had any bearing on understanding what's yeah, happening in the second one? Definitely. You, I think yeah. Watching the first one, yeah, it's definitely. Somewhat it, important, but it not really helped. Needed. Okay. I, I feel like it is. It, it, it helps because you're kind of knowing what's going on and you're like, okay. I mean, they get oh, a little you know, paragraph stuff in the beginning explaining yeah. what's happening, but it's better to watch it yourself exactly. and understand the first yeah. movie. Well, definitely watch it with someone that has watched the movie because it's really hard to kind of pay attention, though. Because you're kind of like, like without him, if I didn't have him there, I probably would have been like, I ain't watching no Blade Runner. Second one. But, yeah. There's a lot of jazz type stuff. Anyway. It was bad. <laughs> it was bad. But the second one was great. All right. Number three. One, two, three. Coco. Wonder Woman. What? Coco. Coco was up there number three for you? Yeah. I like Coco. But I'm on, I, Just the I, music was amazing. It was good. It was a cartoon, of course, so the graphics yeah. and the way they the colors were amazing. The I, uh, Mexican culture, I think, was really I, uh, I well represented. I, I like Coco, but it just, I just I just couldn't make my list. Dude, I almost cried during that movie in the end. I did too, but I just... Uh, it's, if someone could get me that emotional watching a movie, yeah. it has, I have to bring it hot. I... No other hard. movie made me that emotional. It was hard for me. So I wanted to put it up there. I had there, to put it up but, there. Um, for me, uh, Wonder Woman, of course, you know, I had to uh, put it up there. I mean, uh, Gal got it. I, I, I Gal got it. Gal got it. With it with, yeah, I get her name wrong. She was beautiful uh, in that movie. Um, the action was great. I know he didn't really like the rope thing. The rope. That's it, so got, it, I know it, it glows. That always bothered him. He hated the rope. But overall, the, the storyline was great. It looks like she's flinging around a neon light. Um, I enjoyed wow. myself. I love Wonder Woman. It was great. I'd put it up there number three. The, one of the best female hero movies ever. To be honest okay. with you. So, I'd put it up there. I love it. Love the storyline. So, what about yeah. Atomic Blonde? She's a hero. Kind of. Man. Pfft, I ain't, <laughs> man. <laughs> All right. Number two. Number two. One, two, three. Power Rangers. Greatest showman. 
Mm -hmm. What? This may be because we just watched it. Yeah, I think so, too. But the singing, the dancing, the choreography, the story, Mm. it was all wonderful. I really enjoyed that movie. Don't get me wrong, I love The Greatest Showman, but I just, I needed... Uh, that may have been because I just watched it, so it's still recent in my mind, or yeah. some of these movies aren't. Which we're going to so do a review on. That so. might be why the rate is so high, but... I was singing, and not singing, but I was like dancing in my seat to the movie as they were dancing around. I was, so. I was too. I mean, I, I'm not going to... Hey, though, I was tired. Okay? I was beat. I did not want to watch this movie at first. But the... the, the I, and I hate musicals. The only musical I like that's kind of embarrassing. I swear you Todd. Was High School Musical. <laughs> that was the only one I was messing with when I was younger. I love High School Musical. It was good. Oh, okay. I, and I hate musicals. But with this one, I was like, because at first, I didn't know I but it was a musical. musical. Yeah, I, didn't I, didn't, know, I, didn't, I didn't know either. Him either. I was like, well, I should have known with the beginning when they start, start, start singing. Well, I knew that. But when I was like, is this a musical? The only, the only thing I hate about musicals, though, is when they sing every single. I mean, I understand why it's a it's musical, but, musical. But it's like, come on. Drink, drink. It was, it was, just, it was just bad. It was Dying cow over here. Yeah, uh, it was. Just, yeah. Um, what I chose? Uh, what I chose? Power Rangers. Yeah. Y'all, y'all already know why. I mean, it was fun. It was I good. love Power Rangers. Um, it, the sad part, the only thing that's sad about this is that they're not making another one. They didn't make enough money, so apparently they're not doing a second one. Um, but overall, I felt the movie was phenomenal. I thought it was great. Um, it made me like Power Rangers again. I didn't like Power Rangers at first. Um, really? When I was a kid, I mean, I kind of did, but it was so corny. I just didn't want to watch it. Well, when I was a kid, it didn't seem corny though. Yeah, well, yeah, as that a was kid, cool. like, yeah, the choreography and then dancing, the but, fighting is like oh, it's but, amazing. Yeah, but after watching this though, it made me just hate the original. Old, original, not hate it, but it just made me go. I wish it would have did something budget like this. This is so great. This is a well, phenomenal, they have budget phenomenal movie. You can't have that type of level of stuff in the yeah, early no, days. No, but the way they told the story though, it was just phenomenal. Oh, yeah. I love the story. It was just great. But it's sad that they're not gonna. Make another one, so um, it's 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 crazy. What's my mouse doing? I don't know. Are you moving something? It's over there. That's what's scary. Anyway. Yeah, that's scary. Before okay. we reach our number one on the list, yeah. we're going to go through our honorable mentions. I have is. how many do you have? Four, three, four. About but yeah, four. Six, seven, eight, nine, oh, twenty-four. Yeah. What about five? All right, yeah. we're not going to talk about these anymore. We're just going to say these yeah. are should have been on the list somewhere if there's no other movies there. They're, yeah. They were all close to being on it our was, top, was, top, was, top wait, ten. Wait, wait, wait. Well, actually, it's right. just four for me. Yeah. yeah, I got four. My top four are Spider-Man, Homecoming. Okay. I really enjoyed the movie. Power Rangers on there. Cure for Wellness. That was a really good one, I thought. You didn't, I don't think you saw that one, did you? No. Okay. And Split. And Split. Did you see oh. that one? No. Oh. Yeah. Just the whole... Uh, I'm not gonna talk about it. Anyway, me's uh me was Cars three. I wanted to put it on there, but I just couldn't do really? it. I love. I wanted to put Cars really? three. I didn't enjoy um, Cars that much. Surprisingly, Dunkirk. Dunkirk. I wanted to put it on there. I just. Uh, I, I just not being on one of these. Uh, Jumanji. I wanted to put it on there, but I just couldn't. I just. I just. I just. I just wasn't. Uh, it's hard to explain. I wanted to put it on. I really did, but just didn't make the cut. And uh, King Arthur, I wanted to get it. Mm-hmm. I wanted to put it on there also, but just just didn't make cut also. So, yeah. King Arthur didn't enjoy it all that much. I enjoyed it a lot, but yeah. they made it almost too modern feeling with all the rock and all that stuff. It felt like a, le- a leather biker game. I, I liked thing. it. So I enjoyed it. I, I love the movie. Like, they just changed way a lot, a lot of it. Anyway, number one, number our one. top ten move. Our top. Why well, is it? We, we, we do this separate. We do this. Are we do separately? Yeah, okay. we do this separate. Right, go ahead. You want to go first? My number one movie. Surprisingly, was Logan. I had to put Logan up there as number one. That movie, the Are ending. You? Same here. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm Logan. <laughs> I got Logan. <laughs> Dang it. What? Okay. Wow. We did this completely separately, by the way. Wow. It's the first time hearing about it. Are you serious? It. Yeah. Yo, I, I, Lo. Logan's on the list. Logan's on the right there. Oh, snap. Yo, I mean, oh. well, well, I'll, I'll let you go first while you, want, while you chose Logan. The mixture of realism, which I, of course, love, the whole yeah. him dying, the drama, everything that's happening, with the uh, superhero effects. Yeah. Them being mutants and him losing his powers and having powers, at the same time as trying to struggle, survival, realism, all stuff. Yeah. The original X-Men, they are superheroes, they're out fighting all this stuff. But him, he's right. struggling to survive, the mutants are on the run, they're living bad, dirty, and all that stuff, and they're just struggling to survive. I love that gritty realism yeah. mixed with the superhero bit. Uh, for me, it was well, a... I'm looking uh, for the, over to the new mutants coming up, with the horror super movie. Super uh, movie. For me, I love Logan because it was a closer for Hugh Jackman. That we know that, of. That. that we know of. I don't know. Fox did say... He might be coming back. Or that he may be coming back. Right? right. But I had to choose this one because the ending was great. It was a good um, send-off. The storyline. I mean, it was a great send-off. Yeah, pretty much it was a great send-off. Great Logan send-off as well great. as great... 
continuation of the series, yeah. a way to yeah. bring the new generation. Right. I, I loved it. And that's why it's number one up there. This is, it, was and, a, it was an excellent movie. Uh, this, is, was, uh, this was great, man. I really am surprised by some of the choices. So am I. Some of the choices. Uh, I totally yeah. thought Aliens was going to be on there somewhere, but... Yeah, I Just, was yeah, yeah, I was in shock because you don't have aliens up there. Wow, I'm very proud of you. That you actually told shut up, truth. Robert. I'm proud of you, man. Because usually you would uh, just put aliens up there just because you love aliens. Betrayed but the queen. Yeah, but uh, but yeah, man, I'm proud of you, man. Uh, yeah. but yeah, man, I, I'm a shocked and aliens is not. I'm, hey, I'm shocked yeah. right now. All right, wow. so he showed Tupac over aliens. Wow, that's crazy. Stop bringing that up. <laughs> I'm happy, man. I'm happy, man. You actually uh, really, right. you know, chill slip stuff, man. When I'm, when I'm editing this, make an alien come in and bite his head off. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> see, see if we can edit that in. All right. Um, I think that's all I have to say about this. Yeah, uh, this is good closing for the year. We've yeah, seen almost all of them. There's a lot more movies we haven't seen, of course. Yeah. Those are not included because we haven't seen them. Right. And I'm sure this list could be altered greatly if we've seen some of the less yeah. than uh, blockbuster-ish movies that came yeah. out. There's, probably, there's a lot of movies. I think we went through hundreds of movies, and we only saw, yeah. like, I think, 40 of them. Yeah. That came actually came out to the, the main I mean, it was hard. You know, so. this, this was our first movie review-type YouTube thing we did. So, I mean, surprisingly, I mean... Hopefully 2018 will do more movies, more yeah. covers, a lot better stuff. So yeah, let's go yeah man. It's, I'm, just, I'm just happy, man. I've been Like I said, I've been waiting to do this all year. I'm sure you have. And um, I'm very in shock of his choices. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, you were saying I would be biased or something. No, yeah. I'm, yeah, fairly honest with you myself did, at you, least. You did a good job, man. I mean, uh, especially with uh, not that. Check out the top ten most anticipated movies, and then look at this too, because uh, I want to see. Quality video. Yeah, well, it may be terrible quality, but it was great, though. Man, I like the movies. It's crazy because we we went from choosing those movies to maybe I think what one, two, three, four, five movies that was on my list Star on my anticipated Wars, list. Uh, it was five of them. He did his on notebook. I didn't mind the back of a letter. Yeah. Or an envelope. Well, I'm, I'm, well, the first time you did, you typed yours. <laughs> yeah, I actually typed out ready yeah, to go. Yeah, that's just crazy. Lazy crap. It's, yeah, man. All it's, right, so I think it's all to say for this video today. Uh, we have our top ten most disappointing slash worst movies of the year in our opinions yeah. coming up soon, as well as our hopefully our review for uh, uh, the Greatest Showman. The Greatest Showman. Yeah. We just saw that literally last night, so yeah. it's. That may be why it's my number two because I really enjoyed it, but it's still fresh in my mind. Yeah, I was, I was, I was very surprised I chose that one. So I'd like to thank you for joining me today, Rubino. Hey, no problem. Couldn't man. do it without you, man. Hey, man. Hey, dog. We come a long way from the most anticipated movies to see this. Like we definitely, like you definitely changed my mind on a lot of these movies. You really did. That's the point. I mean, I'm just shocked. So I'd like to thank you all for joining us today. Uh, hope to see y'all next time. Yeah, man. Oh, check out my uh, channel, Rubino eighty seven. Uh, I do top fives also on there and reviews and trailer reactions with him also. And just for there. plugging things, go check out Fearbot Gaming, my gaming channel. We have all the gaming content, gaming news type stuff, and gaming uh, Let's Play stuff going on over there. So it's anything good stuff. gaming. Yeah, anything gaming. <laughs> all right. Uh, we'll hope to see you all next time. Yeah, man. It's your boy, Ben7. I'm Real Nick Seal. We'll catch you later. Bye. Peace out.